Welcome to the Peace Educational Program. The purpose of this educational program is to help you discover your own inner resources and the possibility of personal peace. The program consists of 10 videos, each focusing on a different theme. Peace, appreciation, inner strength, self-awareness, clarity, understanding, dignity, choice, hope, contentment. The contents of this educational program is based on excerpts from Prem Rawat's international talks. Prem teaches us people live in two minutes, the minute that just happened and the minute that's on its way, you know, the past and the future. He teaches us to live in the third minute, which is the here and the now. If you can just stop and appreciate just being alive, it puts everything else in perspective. What is so exciting from an educator's point of view about the Peace Education Programme? is that it focuses an individual through listening and reflecting on innate tools already available to them. Peace also has been placed inside of you. And not only is it precious, but there is abundance of it. True education is about providing tools that set students up for life. My experience with facilitating the Peace Education Programme is that the program presents a different kind of learning. The program is designed to promote self-awareness and self-discovery. The measures of learning are gauged individually by one's own self. Premier Watt's videos and the concepts that he uses are innately human concepts. You don't need any special education to have an understanding of those concepts. They are articulated in a way that are accessible to anybody. He says, explore this because it might be good for you. Think about you, your life, your existence. This is the final presentation of our conference, the Peace Education Program, which is being sponsored by the Primble Watt Foundation. These men have all been students of the Peace Program. I can enjoy just because I'm alive, and we need to look at that more often. And you learn that from watching the DVDs. These videos here, they helped me. So many ways and so many situations that you can use these tools of peace and apply it to your life. I wish I would have had it sooner. I could have probably mend a lot of things. Si, la paz es inevitable. La paz es un Un, un, algo fundamental en la vida porque si no hubiese paz hubiese solo guerra en un video que tú mismo nos hiciste ver que decía que la paz sí es posible pero cuando primero estemos en paz nosotros mismos y debería ser la educación porque nuestra la educación no solo te debe dar cosas para la mente no ciencia debe darte conciencia también no el bien ser Esta es nuestra comprensión del mensaje de Plan Ravel y que estamos transversalizando todo en la educación en la provincia de Imbabura. My name is Birgitte Nielsen. I'm a retired teacher. We thought of offering the Peace Education Program in the AOF, a nationwide educational system for adults. In this region, in the AOF, we call it the art of knowing yourself. The students' response to the workshop was very positive. What the program taught me was that I am responsible for my own happiness. Peace is inside me. It's not something that's going to come around the corner, but it's something that I have within at all times. And now I know that I am the miracle. I'm alive and I'm very thankful. Around the world, the Peace Education Programme is being presented to a diverse range of people in a diverse range of environments. Colleges, universities, adult education programs, correctional facilities, veterans organizations, hospitals, retirement communities. This is really exciting. One thing I'd like to share with other people who are considering hosting a PEP is that you can just feel confident in this material. It is such a powerful presentation. People love it.
I go to Cambridge University. I thought a very poignant thing that Prem Rawat said was that education is not just about heads full of equations, but of what it is to find peace within ourselves. I think that's very relevant to students. I'm also at Cambridge University. We're always really busy, like running from lectures to lab. What Prem Rawat spoke about, that it's not about creating something new, but it's about discovering something that you already have. Real peace is a feeling inside every single human being. The peace I am talking about is a peace that is not taught, but a peace that people have a thirst for innately that transcends borders, countries, lifestyle.